Pharaoh's as-built software rides on the robust AutoCAD platform. It offers many different workflow options. This particular video will showcase the catalog-driven pipe extraction toolset. In this piping example, the user is able to take advantage of multiple viewing states. We're now looking at the scan navigation view. This view offers a higher fidelity of the point cloud, which is essentially a single scan position. Next, the user selects the walk the run tool. This is essentially a catalog driven pipe extraction tool. As you can see, the user clicks on the desired pipe and the wizard will pop up with best fit options. Uh, the wizard will automatically assume that it is a six inch pipe if that is the diameter of the pipe that has been selected. And then along that route, it will follow in a particular direction. And if it runs into objects such as the flange, as you can see, then it will automatically populate flange options or valve options for the user to approve. If it finds a bend in the pipe, then it will insert bend options such as a 90 degree elbow. And the wizard will continue to follow along that pipe and allow the user to approve the selections. And that is what's happening right now. If the piping area is not clear enough to insert a flange such as that example, you also have the high fidelity images that are directly connected to the AutoCAD uh, point cloud. And so from there, the user can select a flange in between the bolts and very accurately place that flange and then complete the pipe run. So the user is now just making a series of completion clicks and allowing that pipe to finish out. At this point, the user has finished modeling the pipe. Now it's time to convert this into a plant 3D object, which is a native Autodesk format. Uh, currently, it's in a Qubit format, which is a native Faro as built plugin format. So we just need to convert this over. And so it's a simple little wizard that you select the particular member that you just modeled and you run through the, the model conversion wizard. And so you can convert it to a plant 3D object or a Revit MEP or an other generic file type, such as an SD and F file and the user is choosing to convert it to a plant 3D object. This will allow us to take it to one more step and convert this into a general shop drawing, a 2D option. So now that this is a plant 3D object, we select the entirety of that uh, piping run. And then we have an option to convert this to an, a to a isometric. And so once the isometric is ready, it will just run in the background. You will have this pop up, and now you have a very detailed out bill of materials 2D drawing. There are many workflows available with the as built plugin for AutoCAD, but in this video, we highlighted some of the piping tools and some of the workflows available that will allow you to more accurately, more quickly, and more easily model laser scan data.